We're coming to you live from Tombstone, Arizona. It's sold out Chimera Stadium. This is global warming at its finest, folks. It's a scorching 116 degrees today, but thankfully, it's a dry heat. This game is gonna be a wholesale slaughter. No discounts in the MFL. The team storm the field. The micro hard mutilators face off against the Cardinal Sins. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. See that boo, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> Welcome to another game day here on the MFL Network. Grim Blitzrow along with my partner, Brickhead Mulligan. How you doing? Great city, isn't it, Bricks? Fantastic city. My motel even has free color TV. Oh, that's and nice. an ice machine that works. Wow. There was police tape blocking the bathroom because of the photographers in there, but other than that, no complaints. They, they give you free jelly at breakfast, too. Sounds like a real winner. the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. Second down and five. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Hot eight. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? <laughs> and that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot one. Hot two. Hot two. Oh, and he might have just saved a touchdown on that deflection. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. One speed engage. What are you trying to impress your nerd fan base to bring him into the game? And of course, Junior, they got great disposable income. Yeah, good point. And it's first and ten. And the defense jumps outside trying to mute him. It's not how many times you fall. It's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular case, I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline. Yeah, an eight ball wouldn't hurt either. Did somebody say cocaine? First down and five. The QB might as well just bury himself now. That, my friends, was an all-pro MFL hit. Second down and five. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay him for the pick six. For this, you just give him a pat on the head and tell him they don't suck. Third down and five. Wow! The quarterback just caught that passes for a touchdown. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good! Uh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Yeah. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. Oh, uh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. And 
And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. Oh, that was a great throw and a great catch. Oh, what a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. Second down in a lot. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. He refuses to go down. And he's off to the races. And he bursts into the end zone for the score! What a run! <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Boom! And it's first and ten. Second down and long. Pass and catch for three. The receiver needs to break some tackles. Third down and eight. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. First and ten. And he gets three yards on that run. Second down and seven. Boom to the moon! Another loser bites the dust! In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And it's first and ten. That pass play nets him seven yards. Oh, no. I got the hiccups again. What are you supposed to do to get rid of him again? You stick it in the plastic bag. Say the alphabet backwards while you set yourself on fire and jump out the window. It ought to stop him. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. Does anyone have a rule book? Because that sounds like he's making stuff up. Ah, uh, do we have a rule book? It's propping up your chair so you can reach the table without spilling your food, idiot. <laughs>
second down and more. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Well, you can check dead ref off your mutant bingo card at home. One down. That didn't take long. I don't even get out of it. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. That pass play was good for three yards. Third down and forever. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sweeties this morning. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Wim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, the, the few low expenses, that is. And it's first and ten. Second down and a lot. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Yo, seriously, man, if you go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me, I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. Pow, with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? Second down and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And that'll bring up third and one. And he'll pick up the first down with a nice... Oh, holy smokes! He just killed that player with a cheap shot! That's why we love the MFL! It's anyone's game still at this point. I know, which makes it so hard to place a bat. And it's first and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to have more. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that. First and ten. At this point with multiple interceptions. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Yo, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? And 
And it's first and ten. Ouch! What is this? Andy's wrestling? Second down and nine. If that hit didn't quibble him, it certainly left skid marks. First down and seven. And that's just a great run for a touchdown. And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. No, oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Second down and long. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. to the house. Oh, oh, oh. That gets me every time. Like a jack and the offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. He is fighting for every yard. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Hey. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called. The kick is good! And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. And what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. And they'll keep the drive alive as he rifles it in there and picks up seven yards.
Second and three. Four. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completion. Oh, nice hit. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Sticks his fingers in the defender's eyes, hitting him a pickup of about eight on the play. Second down and two. And that is caught for a first down. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. And it's first and ten. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. The offense is down to their last running back. No rest for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. And that'll be second and eight to go. It's two-yard run before he stopped. Third down and six. And he's running like a... And he snags it for six! Touchdown! Touchdown! He need to call an attack ref dirty trick and stop. Doing fine by themselves. Third down and offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Nice deflection. For a kick this far, you just got to kick it as hard as you can, partner. And aim. It's really important from this distance. It's probably a smart idea. He's got the distance, and the kick is good. crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep, third grade. Sister Mary Margaret and our ladies of holy hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's... Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, Grim.
And it's first and ten. And the dick, this guy's a brick shit house. And he finds open space, is running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. And it's first and ten. That run is good for nine yards. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done! Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. And they run it in for two points. for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. Ah, another interception. Easy kill. Oh, with the punishing hit. It might make more sense to punt here than attempt a field goal. This is way long. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. They need a good return here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It, it means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. <laughs> the offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. Welcome back. Hope you enjoyed the carnage during today's halftime show. 
Obviously, they need to play a lot harder here in the second half to make a game of it. Or they can start cheating and killing. That's what I'd do. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Him. Needless to say, with seven crazed defenders coming after him, that's not easy. Ah, the old quarterback shellac play. <laughs> the offense is down to their last quarterback. If they lose him, they lose the game. First down and nine. And another interception. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. And it's first and ten. And the defense just knocked the wind out of that quarterback. Hey man, I was here on the channel now. You know what happened? Second down in a very lot. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. Third down, and, well, good luck. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross stitching, unbelievable. And it's first and ten. And that's another turnover for the defense. Boom! Hey, yeah, uh, Fritz, check the rule book. Is that a penalty? Why would I have the rule book? Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> First down and five. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. First down and three. And he runs it in for the touchdown.
Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. Really? Two-point plays are high risk, high reward, and it just didn't pay off. Did not have ball screwed and stupid. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grim. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. The defense has the receivers covered well. And that's a three-yard gain on that pass. Second down and seven. Hot. Man, he just laid the wood on him on that one. And he's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. That the ref just received a pair of very expensive alligator skin shoes. They need to put some cement shoes on them before this game slips away. I always wanted a pair of alligator skin shoes, Grim. Yeah, I heard though when you put them on, they feel just like chicken skin shoes. And it's first and ten. Defense had enough with this ref and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Like a, oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. And oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. The offense lost their final quarterback. Lucky for them, they're on defense now or the game would be over. Uh, so all the other team has to do is pop the force of forfeit? That would be correct, Bricks. First down in a mile. Point with multiple interceptions. The QB. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. The Cardinal fans ruthlessly destroy the opposition and win by forfeit. The entire game was trench warfare. Both teams battling back and forth, bruised and battered, but in the end, there could be only one winner. There are winners in my book. I think that a feeder team should get a participation award because uh, I tried really hard. Why don't you try real hard to shut the fuck up? Nice mouth. Why don't you try to lay off the Scots, Junior? Suck on it. Real nice. Let's go to the game's MVP. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.